Throwback Thursday. Welcome back. We are in Nax Ramus and um, got the next batch, man. We got the next batch, and we built a timeless, not timeless. It is very, it is very much not timeless. We built uh, a historic deck from Hearthstone, and we are hoping to continue to do so. Just play, you know, decks that were good ones, you know, from previous metas, metas of the past. This one's a Cthulhu Priest. This is a very thrown together Cthulhu Priest. There's people out there who don't know like any cards in this. Um, Cthulhu came Dude, with Forbidden Words is like currently in the meta. Yeah, uh, Cthulhu came with um, with uh, the Old Gods expansion, obviously, and we have some Legends of the Past there, like like Lich King. Um, is like Thor's also current meta, by the yeah, way. I meant I didn't mean that literally. I meant the you know the, the central cards. Um, and what Cthulhu does is, in case you don't know, uh, that's that's fine. Um, <laughs> The, whole, help but the whole archetype is around. What? I guess I get those two if I play this. Let's get him. I also assume that he summons more of them over the combat. I don't remember. I've played this right. once, but then let's not get him. Okay, weird thought, right? What? Do I power word shield them? And the other one is should we have played combo priest? But no and no. Just pass because I get draw and I can I can I steal them mm. later, right? And I think since I steal seven health minions. We probably should have um, played think, Combo Priest. I think we're good. We wanted to play historic stuff. so Combo Priest is a do. very historic deck. Yeah, yeah. So basically what I was saying, um, the uh, Cthulhu concept revolves around uh, buffing up your Cthulhu. That's one of the old gods, obviously. You're going to buff him up, buff his attack, and when you play him, his battle cry is to deal a damage equal to the amount of attack randomly split. And that's a big one. Why would he do that? Whatever. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and buff this Cthulhu up. We have a Cthulhu's, we have the Disciple there. Yes. We be using it. I guess we Yeah. hit it in the one minion where it makes sense. Maybe we should grab these other studies at some point, you know? Yes, I couldn't help but think that. I was just thinking there must be a reason why they don't like... I just take them. Oh, right, it's a crystal on the board, right, I remember. Because they're clever like that, they actually use the board there. Massive. Um, I think we heal our face yeah. and kind of obvious. Take it easy and then just kill the 2-1. Kill the 2-1, deal 3 damage to him, yeah. Yeah, so basically what we're gonna do is we buff our Cthulhu. We already saw it once. He's got more of these rune blades, which is why it's good to have these other studies. Um, we're gonna now probably play Cthulhu's Chosen. Get more buffs in. Yes. Uh, the question... Be. You'll see Cthulhu pop up in the bottom left corner. Yes, and also um, Deck Tracker mm -hmm. tracks the stats. The question is, do we want to get rid of the Acolyte? And I guess the answer is no. Yeah, no. That's chill. Um, He's not going to draw from here. Now that he has 10, by the way, our Twilight Darkmander heals us 10 when we play next turn. Which is very important. That's going to negate the, um, the blade, which we need. So, yeah. Hashtag negate the blade. Hashtag negate the blade. Fam, play the Dark Mander. Cthulhu's growing already once we Cthulhu hit. Cthulhu is not growing from the Dark Mander, by the way. Just chose it yeah. again to reaffirm that it's working. Once we basically. play it, he's gonna he's gonna unleash damage. Yes, right. So the way Cthulhu works is, uh, he battle cried. I explained damage. it Did you? exactly, okay. like like literally exactly. Like you know, I don't listen to you, two right? minutes ago because you were going on about how freaking uh, the the crystal board interaction, for fancy art stuff. So. Yes, that's how Cthulhu works. So, uh, hopefully we'll draw him, assume we hit 10 mana, and just uh, save By the way, the Weaponsmith, right? He would have dealt 14 with a weapon, but mm -hmm. with that that's, being in rage. That's pretty tough, that's a lot. Yeah. But we can clear it off now. And we can play a Doomcaller. Okay, so Doomcaller... Very optimally, you'd have played a Cthulhu semi-early, you play Doomcaller, you get another Cthulhu out that's of it. That's why we have two Doomcallers. Yes. Optimally, you just kill with your first Cthulhu and you just win with it. Yes, that too. Mm, yeah. Play it easy. Play Zilliax? Sure, let's put some stuff on the yep. board. Can't be wrong. It was wrong! Was it wrong? We baited out a brawl of two minions. Not sure how wrong that was. And Zilliax even lays. I mean, maybe you would have played brawl with just one minion. Yeah, okay. Oh! That's interesting! What? He plays Cleave with what? just one minion. I mean, yeah. Which you couldn't do when this was originally no, made. No, but now you can. But, I mean, I guess... I would assume that the boss AI is the same one for all the bosses. Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. So, 
like, all right, well, so. <laughs> if car changes didn't apply to all the, uh, to old stuff, that wouldn't work. As a Thorson? Mm-hmm. Oh, wait, Thorson and a Forbidden... Forbidden Words? That makes... Yeah, I guess it works. I think that's good. Thorson, really strong card. Uh, main, main reason why it's in this deck is because we have some other top-heavy stuff, like the Doomcallers, yeah. the Lich King, the Cthulhu. Um, it's going all face everything, man. What was that? That is just regular AI stuff. He's like, oh, my taunt has to attack. What was that? That was terrible. Alright, it could be Spirit Lash time, huh? Yes. Um, like Even Holy Nova with it. I was about to say Holy Nova and Spirit Lash, right? Yeah. Spirit Lash first, maybe. For, for more. one extra healing to face. Yeah. yeah, I realize that now. And we can still play Cthulhu's shows and kill that dude and. Yeah. And we get a minion from our deck, which actually no. could have been Cthulhu, which wouldn't have been that so, bad. That would have been amazing. Because the buffs would still apply. Yeah. Uh, so, I was about to say, let's yeah. save our Emperor here. Hooded Acolytes, too. It's gonna... Yeah, this Cthulhu's going nuts. With the Hooded Acolytes, you can get him to like 50 attacks on Also, by the way, um, the fun thing is, because we have Bran in this deck, yeah. we can actually, with Thorison, potentially at one point... Rainbow. Get both on one turn, yeah. Dark Mender is massive and just pain the other guy. Uh, what is this guy? Them. Destroy him. Yeah. Easy. Don't mind if I do. We'll take it. We'll take it. And I'm back to full. Easy. I love this deck. So easy, so easy. Yeah, I love love the, this yeah it's great. It's, oh, everything's great when you play against something that's 20 years older. <laughs> so. Like, Old Gods is also pretty old. Oh. No pun intended. It is. Um, GG's! Oh yeah, that, by the way, that happens all the time. Like, the Cthulhu priest back in the day when I played it, oftentimes just wins because it has a lot of actually strong minions. Yeah. Because the Cthulhu minions usually aren't underpowered. Like, they're, they're, yeah, they're vanilla down. stats. Yeah. Exactly. Alright. Gothic. Got the Harvester. The Harvester. Um, hero power is the upgraded Warlock hero power. Right. Which is to say, draw two card. mana draw a card. Let's harvest. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta harvest, we gotta harvest this guy, with with our Cthulhu stuff. Yes. <laughs> Let's walk it to him. He's got a good, he's got a nice beard though. Can't hate him. Not sure if he's a dog or a man, but he's got a nice beard. <laughs> Beckoner of Evil is a good one. It's good keep. Yes. Uh, Even Power Shield is good. We'll, we'll keep uh, both of those. I usually drop Shield if I don't have a other one drop, but then shield again, the only one in this card. deck is Cleric, so. Shield is such a... You never kick shield. Shield is, outside of Cleric, the best priest keep every time. Ooh. Remember Unstable Ghoul? Yes, I do, actually. I do, too. I also have, as you could see, there played all of the bosses, at least so far, already, because I bought the Adventures way back when. Hey, we got him. Bit early, but we have them. How fancy do we want to be? Heal and shield. We don't need to use forbidden words, do we? Well, but if we do use forbidden words, we could full clear. But maybe that's. Maybe. I think healing is always correct. Take just take board, you know. Play Cthulhu's <coughs> play Cthulhu's shows and take nice and easy okay, now, stuff off. Okay, now this guy, however, I do not remember because he's an adventure-specific card, mm. and... What was his text? What do you do with death row? He summons a spectral something for us. Ugh, that's cool. We'll kill him. Soon enough, we'll kill him. We'll get to killing him, don't worry about it. Get around it. to it. We are good. Oh, right, corruption. Right. Cool. His hero power is called Harvest. Oh, right, I think they're just spectral versions of those guys. Oh, fantastic. Well, uh, let's kill the guy. Uh, play the Darkmander? <clears throat> I guess we'll play the Darkmander. Oh, no, wait, no, that's different. It's start of return deal one damage to your hero. Oh, uh, fuck, right, those. Uh, I mean, I, I can kill him you. for free at any point if I really want to, but... You, of course. Right, those ones. Now I remember this <laughs> fight. I remember why this... Yeah. This is actually a... Uh, Reasonably good though for stuff like the uh, Hooded Acolyte. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I guess we'll do this. I guess. Yeah. I mean, there's 
You could disciple to kill uh, the um, yeah to kill the other guy and then. Uh, yeah, I was fun. I was thinking the same thing actually. Good stuff. Cthulhu's twelve twelve at ten. We'll just play him. We'll just unleash the plagues. Just go GGs. That's death. Then it's a face heal. You want to words this? No. Alright. He deals one. Uh, take it easy. Like, I can literally out hero it. power him, yeah. Mm -hmm. Another one. Another one. Yeah, that's basically his entire deck. We'll just play Doomcrawler here. We're pretty much good. Oh. Take it nice and easy. Mm. That really is all he does. Pretty much, yeah. Uh, Including also playing a new card in Unstable Go by new, I mean at the time. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Zilliax time. Very likely. Kill the biggest one. <sighs> Heal Doomcrawler or something. Zilliax dies anyway. Well, no, I need to heal Zilliax because Doomcrawler dies anyway. Oh, Zilliax also dies the same way. The other guy, maybe you should have healed the Zero one. Huh. I'd rather me? not. You feel me, bro? Okay. And we'll play our Cthulhu. Yes! It's game time, bro. Cthulhu's about to rock. Rock this place. First time for many people to see what Cthulhu actually does. Also, I, I just now thought about the fact that this deck could really use... In this matchup specifically, could really use a Shadow with Horror. Yes. Yeah, that's true. Saw that? Just, you just went bang, 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 bang. And now there's a 14-14 on the board, and this is just an easy win. That's what Cthulhu's strong with, when you get him. We should... Mm, right. Um, we should, at some point, maybe, just for the, for the heck of it, on your account, try out uh, Shadow of Cthulhu, and then give, yeah. uh, put uh, Wind Fury in there. Yes, though of course we can't play Nax, we can start that in the later. Yeah, no, that's, that's what I was saying, just regular, just We'll late. do it, we'll do it, yeah. And the Lich King! I have played Shutter, Shutter Thune in Wild for fun before. Yeah. We've well, seen the Lich King. Remember Lich King. the time when the Lich King was not an old school card? Dude, the Lich King was so strong, it was filthy. Easy wins! It's definitely Doom Pack time. Absolutely. Hit with Lich King Doom Pack, right? <laughs> thought so too, thought so too. Boy, the animations. <laughs> Did it? Ah, got him. Legends of the past. Legends of the past. Absolute. absolute and now we face that. the four horsemen. There's four. Horsemen. As led by Baron Rivendare. Boy, four horsemen are also legendary raid fight and wow. Let's play the four horsemen. Are there literally four of them? Like, do they swap or something? Like, how do uh, they? I remember that there is three of them on the board. Right. I don't remember if they swap or if they just have like conditions to them. I th no, I think they make him immune or something. Yeah, okay. he's immune. Uh, and I think you have to kill the horseman and then you can kill the. Boy. You can kill Riven there. Okay, yeah, fair enough. We can do that. That's not. A I don't problem. remember how much health Riven there has because the other guys have seven. Keep everything or kick chosen. Um, I think kick chosen. Right. Hoping to draw Bran or disciple. Disciple. There you go. A Disciple is the most understated one out of the bunch, by the way. Yeah. Like, everything else is kind of reasonable. But it also has the best battle cry with the buff. Yes. Uh, so yeah, they all have 7 and your hero is immune, so... Yeah. one seven, and then he's just a 7 health oh, dude. Oh, that's not even that And strong. his hero power is 5 mana, draw 2. Which is also not that strong, that's by the way. pretty weak sauce, no. I don't remember if there's any other shenanigans, though. Because be. oftentimes there is, especially because it's Frostbolt the final... Frostbolt is as close to shenanigans as it gets with a legit card in the games, I guess. Yeah, but, but that's the thing, right? Legit cards. Yeah. Because oftentimes uh, the bosses will have special cards, and um, for the last boss of a chapter especially, they're often usually the strongest. Mm -hmm. So it wouldn't be too far-fetched to assume that there's some kind of shenanigans. Right. Secret time. Paladin Secret of all things. Repentance? No. Um, is it like the one that gives them plus two health? No, it isn't because that's way too new. Yeah. No how, how, why does Deck Tracker not know this, by the way? No, what? That some decks, some secrets aren't possible in this mode. Um, 
I... The Hail Face, I think. Or play the Cleric. You can play Cleric and then Circle, but then you heal his. No, no. Um, so, I assume it's because if they discover one, for example, they can get all of yeah. them. I think there's a feature where I can manually uncheck them in the deck tracker, but I think that yeah. autumn also disables auto um, doing it, so... What does this do? Okay. Oh. Right. Yeah. Should have circled before, yeah. maybe, but this is still fine. Oof. Foreshadowing. Is it, though? Yeah. He's talking about the Scourge way before uh, friggin' uh, um, Frozen Throne was a thing in, in uh, Hearthstone. Not bad. But it's next Ramus! It's all about the Scourge! Well, but it's not Frozen Throne. So. I don't know, man. This, this is all of a sudden he's looking pretty right. strong. Right! He can yeah. buff them, that's why. And we have nothing. Well, we drew very poorly so far. Yeah. Um, and that is not what we're looking that for at all. That is nothing. We should have circled when we had uh, when we had the uh, clerics. What? But uh, for draw, yeah. But yeah, I mean, yeah, for draw. Forbidden words is great in this matchup. So would have been mm -hmm. pain if we don't run because forbidden words is better. Uh, by the way, another one for uh, Shadow Horror. Yeah. Do you want to actually uh, literally adjust this deck to have Shadow Horrors in it, will we? Uh, if you lose, I think we'll just yeah. Put some stuff in here. Because <laughs> that's like an instant win, basically. We'll definitely do that. Yeah, this is lost. What? I'm trying to think, right? His weapon has one, so it's You have seven. to heal your face. So we have to heal. And then play and pass. Yeah. Which doesn't help us with anything. Oh, great. Yeah, we'll put Chadwood Horror in this, I think. I think that makes sense. And then we just have to mulligan hard for it. Just win it easily. That's what we're going to do. I think we'll just adjust this poorly for this matchup. Yeah. Um, I like some of the AoE damage we have, but we might just what do take, you take out of place. Um, I was thinking maybe take out the lashes because we, uh, although they are good healing as well. Yeah. Lashes are good. Uh, wait, I can I can go in here and then yeah. go to the collection. We'll take uh, we'll keep the lashes in. I think spirit lash, but Chadwick Horror is an instant play. Um, um, let's see what we can take out here. Oh, do we actually put um, Shadow Visions as well? Oh, uh, you only have one horror, first of all. That's unfortunate. Oh, um, I do only have one horror. Huh. Mm -hmm. uh, we can put Twilight Elder. He's very slow. Yeah. Um, I, don't we, think, I don't think I don't think we're good. Do we put a pain in there or something? I, mean, I yeah. feel like... Take, I, take I think... both deaths, put both pains. We don't need deaths right now at all. Right. Good Let's do that. call. I think we have not that. See if we can, uh... And this is how we're supposed to do it, by the way. Like, not... Adjust, adjust your deck. Maybe necessarily with newer cards, yeah. but... Just just for the matchup. Mm -hmm. uh, Shadow Death... Uh, Shadow Pain was a was a thing back then. So it was, like, cards like Holy Nova, yeah. which is very... And horror was here. not. Horror was so not. Nice. But we liked the cheese. Yeah. Is Baron Rivendell's horse dead? It appears that way, yes. How, does he, how, how can he still ride it? Okay, I'm gonna... Get, am I gonna keep the circle? Yeah. Yes. Because now if I get Spirit Lash, I can just draw It has proven worthy, alright? Pain. Feel my pain. That is definitely good. And some secret. Ye sniveling oaf. Right. Well, he doesn't have Spellbender. That's pains him. Uh -huh. Okay, that's mm. not as bad Better as Better in Redemption, thought. I guess. I thought the same thing. Um, Now, of course, this doesn't die anymore to, to horror, horror. So, that that's kind of else. eliminated itself from the equation there very fast. Um, Zilliax... Deals with one of them relatively nicely, although likely won't exactly. But then with some little bit of AoE damage, or even just straight up. Well, <sighs> that's huge. Let's just have been yeah. another Avengers, like ugh. <laughs> I would just need like forbidden words or something to just kill us. Yeah. Spirit of X next turn, maybe. I mean, it depends on what we draw, but. Oh. 
didn't even do anything. Yeah, he's a witch. Smack him. What? Oh, it's repentance. Ah. It's fine. Ah. I I mean, that, that means that he's gonna run his face in there rather than the minion. Yeah. But that's still fine. We don't get the life steal. Right, that is true. Still. And... Of course, Dark Matter isn't doing anything at this point. I think we just play a Thorson. No. Get our stuff and our healing's cheaper. Yeah, and also, like, if he trades the minion in, which he, of course, doesn't. Mm -hmm. yeah, so he always seems to have a Frostball cheese whenever he needs it like that. Crazy. Um. I think it has to be Bran Beckner. And he'll face. And he'll face, yeah. because yeah. then... then the I don't think the Bran is going to stake, but at least the Black Runner is active yeah. at all. Um, of course, if we had one more mana, we could have played all three. We would have been back to full. Mm -hmm. But this is important. If we don't die, we... No. Not quite. Not quite. But yeah, Dark Matter is pretty much forced now. Get this, uh... Get this health up. Really good with Akanai, by the way. Just yeah. as a side note. Yeah, it's fantastic. Let's play shield. And heal the face. Heal the face. Both of those heal the face equally. Yeah. I, I like this one. Yes, I do. I do too like this one. Oof. That's <laughs> the spell. Yeah, draw Talk two is about what's good. But also, like, just a straight trade yeah. right now. Noble Sacrifice? Probably what not. is he gonna silence? Oh, right, uh, the sack, huh? To be expected. I mean, we still have to hit it. Yeah. Nope. Could be a repentance. Oh, uh, redemption, redemption, sorry. Yeah. Uh, which is fine. Then our dice is Spirit Lash, though. Ooh, all right. Taking some sacrifices there. I see. That's cool. I, I I'd rather have the health. You want to push point. holding over too? And I was about to say now I can push holding over if I want to, which Dark. I think I do. And would you look at that? We win. Out. I just got one extra healing out of doing we, it in that order. We we be winning. I had one blade for the massive damage. Cool. cool, cool, cool. I mean that's part of balancing the match, of course. And by the way, the secret is avenge. In case you couldn't yeah. tell, because sacred trial is too new. Mm -hmm. But Avenge might never happen here. Dark Matter is... GG! I also don't know if he has other minions. I don't think so. Probably not. So that's only useful when... Um, when his dudes are active. Yeah, Mark of the Horseman is generally yeah. pretty good, but whatever. Um, we got a... Corruption! We got him as Rock of why not? Nope, nope, doop, doop, doop. But we got him. Almost. We beat... Yeah, the closest thing you can get, I guess. We beat... Um, the... The dude driven there on his dead horse. On the second try. They say you shouldn't beat dead horses. Well, they need to shut up. Because <laughs> we just did it. Uh, let's do the class challenges, man. Yes, let's see which let's ones belong in here. And there's two of them. There is Shaman and Warlock. Gothic and Riven there. Mm. Or the horseman, rather. The horseman. Dude, what? devolve, right? Devolve. I mean, it's the same as horror, yeah. but... But it's not in there, though. No, I was just generally thinking. Yeah, it will be great. So I guess we'll we'll, we'll play this like like it's arena. So um. Yeah. Keep egg and cleric. I was about to say we're not keeping the no, it's no. It's a bit of a no-no. Hex. Frogs. Well, it's not horse horsemen that we're playing. But we'll we'll play horsemen with the warlock, right? Yes. Um. Lego Flames! Right. <laughs> I wish I might play the flame. Wow. Boy. Egg time. Spectral spiders are not beasts. Nope. I, I pointed out last time, I think, but... Because they're spectral. Yeah. I happen to take issue. Yeah. Clear. I don't even know why. It's correct. You always like to be to have it exactly correct. Yes. Like remember when you were all up in arms about which would Grizzly being as a beast, uh, being a beast while he's being depicted as a ghost bear? Um, I know that there was a big thing about it because I made like an entire article just about that. Yeah. But I don't. How much do I mind that? I think I like that, right? Yep, we like that. 
We do be like that. Let's play this. Uh, uh, egg oh, type. I like the egg, yeah. Because we can buff it again. Oh, we can also hex our own dudes. You can also hex, hex his dudes. So we don't even summon it. Fair enough. But, you know, you know how the pros and then, like, the, the trash <laughs> like, they'll hex their own stuff. Remember the pros when they were doing the next round of solo challenges, how they used to hex their own shit? Yeah. No, I, I specifically <laughs> referenced the trash ball, my dude. Yes, pros have hexed their own stuff. I, I was there when it happened. It was, it was glorious. No doubt. We could also buff them with our clerics, um, boy. He attacks the spectral dudes. Yeah, maybe he should have hit face. I mean, it's better than the eggs, but you know, what are you? Over? Egg time. Egg time. <laughs> it hex time though, like his dude, of course. Uh, I think it's, it's, yeah, it's creepy 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 time, huh? Yeah. Oh, he told him. <laughs> The value! <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> Speaking of value. Absolutely awful, yeah, Spectral Spider, massive. Yeah, but, but just one because, yeah. you know, these are the totem. I'll give the spirits taunt. The spirit and the egg. The egg. Oh, right, yeah. Uh. yeah. Improvise, adapt, overcome. overcome. Kill the egg. Kill both. Oh, oh. Easy. Big board, just need bloodlust or something. Is bloodlust in this deck? I would hope so. Oh. Be good if it was, huh? I mean, usually they they build them either after a very specific theme or actually decently good. Um, Let's hope it's good. But there's a lot of eggs in here, <laughs> let's just say that much. Eggs are massive. I mean, we like eggs. Rock Rider. Huh. Yes. Maybe hit that in the other one. I will hit that in the other one. Uh, let's see. On something that, in some spirit that can die. Or in the egg. Uh, let's do egg. I was about to say, yeah, we like eggs around here, don't yeah, we? Yeah, we do like egg. And then we don't even summon the spirit, which is good. Value. Value. And healing. Value. <laughs> Killed something. <laughs> Harvest. Okay. I mean, at some point we need to start egging him in the face because I think the idea of this deck is actually synergy with our eggs. Um, do we? Yeah, play that. And play hex, that hex. Yeah, and hex is boy, and there we go. Um, I guess the idea is to have the egg synergy. Like they want to show you, like, oh, you can taunt up your eggs, you can buff up your yeah, eggs, you can, you can sack them. your eggs. Yeah, exactly. I don't think we've sacked our eggs yet, but you know, we don't have many yeah. sack outlets either. But you know. Maybe. So it's like a tutorial thing. Kind of. Um, okay. This they, Earth Elemental is going to I think the class challenges are in part to introduce you to how you could play with the current cards. Yeah. That's good. Current at the time. I always feel the need to specify yeah. there. Fender. Let's put it in the spirit. And just go, go, go. And now we kill him in two turns. Because Earth Elemental is massive. Literally. Literally, it's it's a huge rock. It has significant mass. Yeah, it's a big rock. You yeah. know, rock star. <laughs> kill, him. kill him perfectly. Yeah, I was about to say you're not gonna leave me alone if I don't, yeah. right? Oh no, no, no. I would also want the uh, spirit lethal. Fair enough. Yeah. Big spirit. Big spirit. One seven taunt. We'll take it. If it does one to us, every <sighs> that's cool. He is undone. Yes, Top he right. is. Tough. Let's do the one. Can we get the horseman? Can you defeat the horseman using the special moral thing? Oh, there's probably going to be corruption in there, huh? I think so, yeah. Because they've been play. Everyone's been playing it. Void caller. Corruption is good against uh, these horse dudes. Yeah. Take it. Keep so far. Yeah. To mm. blade on one? Yeah, it's blade on one. Just not care about our card? No, let's not do it. Why not? Wait, we can tap. Ooh! Ooh! We want to not Fine. care about these cards, bro? You try to not care about this? Okay. Still? I honestly don't care about the one, then. 
Ah, that was the one I wanted to keep. <laughs> that, okay, let's put it that way. That's the one I would have wanted to keep. Yeah. Dread Infernal. Not bad. Tip I, don't, taps? Yeah. I don't think we demon fire anything right now. Wow. Very top heavy. Big stuff. Considering that the horsemen are somewhat aggressive. Yeah. That's actually... They're not demons, obviously. Uh, Void Caller is good. Void Caller is pactable. Yeah, that's pactable. It can bring something something big down. And I think that's the idea, right? You, you play it, you pact it, you get either a 6-6 six, six or a 7-5 that does stuff. Although the 7-5 won't do stuff right away and probably die. Oh, that counts as a demon. That's interesting. But, um, yeah, that counts as a demon. That's cool. I knew that. Uh, I wasn't completely sure about it. I thought so, but I wasn't completely sure at heart. Uh, yeah, that, that was one of those things that people pointed out in the beginning where it's like, he's technically not a demon. Yeah. He's part demon. Yes, and that is exactly it, right? He's also powered by demonic powers. Yeah, so that counts. Intentional wording. I think we now demon fire the 1-3. Alright. And we tap. Tap first. Do we tap? I think we tap. Do we tap? We could play Void uh, Yeah. Okay, so, so with Demon Fire mm -hmm. was that if I play the Dread Infernal, then something dies. But also if I just hit it, yeah. it theoretically... Boy, he's got removal for everything. Yes. But now we play the big play things. done? Now we play the big things. I mean, we're also getting close to dead. Oh! There's our health recharge later on. <laughs> our health recharge. I mean, yeah, if we're going further down, he's a health recharge, alright. I mean, we are already below 15. Yeah. And his weapon deals three. He's got to get there, and he summons. Uh, he summons Infernal infinitely. <sighs> Infernal time. He takes us down to eight as well. Oh. I think. I think there's nothing better we can do right. right now. Um. Boy. That's not lethal. That's nasty, but we don't have Jaraxxus. I mean, it's lethal next turn, but it's not lethal right now. We could get a Pact. Um, we could get a Taunt that also works. So, yep. this obviously. Play the Taunt, which delays our... Demon Fire? Leroy. Demon Fire it, and Demon Fire the dude, right? Oh, uh, sure. Now, if he has another Soul Fire, we're still dead. Or a Death. Boy, what up? We ah. shouldn't have demon fired it. Why did you recommend Re that? There's <laughs> this cheese all the way. Let's do this again. He's, he's got, dude. He's got everything, man. His, his entire deck is full of removal. Like, he's, and I think this is our last try. If we don't get it, we don't get it. Yeah, we don't get it. He can fuck off. You're not supposed to beat that horses. We ain't about to. Hmm. Not doing it. Oh, there's Void Walker. Oh, and remind good me, to know. And remember, it's deader than last time because we've killed it already. Yeah, it's even more dead. You can tell, like. You, like, there's more like, bones like, in this like the now. saying says, don't be the dead horse, even less be the deader horse. Yeah. <laughs> the deader the horse, the less you are to beat it. Because the less sense that it makes. Also, Felgar is really weak. In general. Like. Yeah, that's a 3 5 Todd will probably put it up. Todd is not bad. Yeah, but it's it ha it's, it's one point over stated, it has Todd, and it destroys one of your mana crystals. Yeah. It's better than Snapjaw than like a Ornary Tortoise or not. Um, I think it's worse. Right. Rather take four, five damage than kill one mana? Yeah. If you're a tiny mana, then not. Maybe on three, yes. We'll probably play two of them back to we back, You could also too. just soul-fired one of the horsemen. Yeah. Been a way to do it. He doesn't remove it right now, though, so... Yeah. We actually deal a lot of damage to the horseman right now. That's good. Ooh. Life drainage. We'll play that. What the? Ah. Oh. This is the other one. Ah! Now we've now we so far, though. I mean, we could have drained the other one. Should have probably tapped first because our hand was pretty decent, but... Now we have a lot of drainage. Now we got him. Remember, drain life hits face. Mm -hmm. Or can hit face. Yeah. Well, once face is not. Oh, that's pretty good. That's. Yeah. That's 
too off, but it's pretty good. Oh no, never mind. Uh, but I mean, it's still too off. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and we have another drain. I hate secrets. But actually, Wallet deals with it pretty decently. Um, yeah. Surprisingly enough, more so than Priest. You would have thought that uh, I could have tapped. Eh, whatever. We should win anyway. I preserved my life. Exactly. Life preserved. Infernal time. As long as it's not noble sack, which it isn't. So that's not lethal. Kill it with hit a it, weapon. Hit it. Do hit it. it boy. Do it. Uh, yuck. Disgust. Then do we doom call her? Doom guard? Hey, yes, we do doom guard and Oh Demon Fire. Mm, let Oh boy. We have to uh do yeah. it this way, but yeah. there is like a one in three chance that this is lethal. Nope. Didn't get it. Uh that's well tap. Frostbolt is not a balanced card. <laughs> what? What? I don't understand what he does. Well, Infernal. Just win. Can he push 8? I don't think nah. he... Well, 7. But I don't think he can. I'm not gonna tap. Though. I'm, 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 I'm gonna be a little concerned here. Don't do it. Don't do it. I don't like the AI sometimes. <laughs> it's very sketchy. Uh, like if dude, if the AI with all the cheese cards were even better than it is. Do you just top like that? And then not kill the thing? Yeah. <laughs> I am He wanted that way. He wanted that way. Just <laughs> we got him. Alright. We got the man, all the horses are dead, and now we beat him again, and now we good. The horsemen are dead, which is even more important because they were the real assholes here. Uh, we beat another quarter wing of uh, of um, next Ramus onto the next one in the oh, next. They are thirty. called quarters, and there's five of them. You may continue. St stupid. Um, <laughs> thank you for watching this video. Drop a like on it if you did enjoy it, and uh, turn in for the next Throwback Thursday, where we throw back to Thursdays um, in the past when we play weird past decks and like class challenges and old soul challenges that are no longer in the game for all those who didn't um, start Hearthstone that early. So we'll go through all the previous solo challenge things and play old historic decks, which is fun. So, until next time. JJ. That's it. That's it.